Welcome to Math with Mr. J. In this video, I'm going to cover how to determine the value of an underlined digit. And we're going to be taking a look at three digit numbers. Now this is going to help us better understand place value and numbers in general. So let's jump into number one where we have 335 and the three in the tens place is underlined. So we need to determine the value of that digit. Let's use the place value chart to the right to break this number down. So we have 335. So a three in the hundreds place, a three in the tens, and a five in the ones. Now we specifically wanna look at the three in the tens place. So that three represents three groups of 10. One, two, and three. So the value of that three is going to be 30. Again, because that three is in the tens place, therefore it represents three groups of 10. It has a value or worth of 30. Let's move on to number two, where we have 518. We'll write the number in the place value chart to break that number down as well. So again, 518. A five in the hundreds place, a one in the tens, and an eight in the ones. Now the five in the hundreds place is the digit that we wanna take a look at and determine the value of. That five represents five groups of 100. One, two, three, four, five. That five has a value of 500. Again, because it's in the hundreds place and represents five groups of 100. So let's move on to numbers three and four, and we'll do these without a place value chart. For number three, we have 819. So the nine in the ones place is underlined. That nine represents nine ones. Therefore, it has a value of nine. Lastly, number four, we have 643. The six in the hundreds place is underlined. So we want the value of that six. That six, represents six groups of 100 because again, it's in the hundreds place. So the value or worth of that six is going to be 600. So there you have it. There's how you determine the value of an underlying digit. And we worked specifically with three digit numbers. I hope that helped. Thanks so much for watching. Until next time, peace.